Dylan's birthday is coming up in a couple of months. May 2nd, right? Yeah. How old are you going to be? Seven. He's a big boy now. And um, whenever we go into a store lately, he tells me what he wants for his birthday. Everything from what? What are you, what are you excited about? Um, trucks, cars, Legos. DS? DS. The video game. Um, so he's been telling me all these things that he would like and asking me to put them into my phone so that I won't forget. I won't forget. <laughs> um, but I explained something really important to him about his birthday and about presents. What did I tell you? Do you remember that not, it's not about just receiving presents on your birthday, but what? It's about giving presents to. About giving presents to who? About giving presents to the people that don't have as much as us. And especially kids who don't have as many toys as you have. Do you have a lot of toys? Yeah. You have a lot of toys. And so I have some that I don't use anymore. Yes, that's right. Because you've grown up a little bit. And some of the things you don't play with because they're not as much fun for you. But would they be a lot of fun for somebody else? Yeah. So what did we do? We um, found the parts that go to the toys. And then we looked through all my stuff that I don't use anymore. Mm-hmm. And we found this is a, these are a few things right here that we found that we're going to give away. And what did we find? Talk about some of the toys that you found. Um, we found two trucks. Mm -hmm. I mean three. Yeah, there's a lot of cars and trucks here, right? And this one's really cool because it has some of the original pieces, the Diego piece, and the animals that go in the back of this of this truck for his safari. Um, and um, a lot of these things are practically brand new, and what a waste that they're just sitting in your toy box. So how does it make you feel, buddy, to, to give toys to kids who don't have as many toys as you? It makes me feel really good. And, and do you think that they're going to be excited to play with them? Yes. So we've given, we give stuff away every year, and um, a lot of the times we've given to the Salvation <laughs> Army, I hear you, Rosie, or we give to... Um, the veterans, and they come by in a truck and, and they really help us out um, by picking it up for us. This year we decided that we were going to give to the Lupus Foundation. Um, and you know what? For a long time now, I've been receiving these bags in the mail and I just put them aside. Um, they send these bags all folded up so that you can fill it up. It's a big giant white bag. You can fill it up with all the things you want to donate. It gives you the number right on the bag to call. 888-445-8787, 888-445-8787. You can call the Lupus Foundation of America and they'll tell you when they're going to be in your neighborhood. Leave all your stuff on the doorstep at 7.30 in the morning on the day of pickup and mark it with either this bag or say LFA, Lupus Foundation of America, and they come and pick it all up for you and it's going to a wonderful, wonderful cause. They're helping out a lot of people. Um, so if you would like to do it, you can call that number to schedule your own or donate to whoever you would like, whoever is near and dear to your heart, whatever organization. We are going to find some more toys. We're giving some of your clothes. We're giving shoes and um, other household items that we're just not using anymore. So we think it's really important, right? Yeah. Why is it so important? It's so important because we're giving them t to people that don't have much. Right. And we want to help out. So we hope that you'll help out too and look through your house because we've all got stuff that's just it's just sitting there going to waste and it can it can really do a, a whole lot of good for, for people in need. So we are gonna continue collecting. We gotta get it all bagged up and out on the front steps for pickup. And um and we'll uh we'll let you know how it goes. So we'll see you later. Bye. Bye.